80 Day Shave 45 Morning Show. I am your host, Mr. Thanksgiving DJ Drama. We got the homie Weezy on the phone. Now, um, it's some sad news, Weezy. You know the homie Ja Rule just uh, got sentenced yeah. to two years for that situation, yeah. man. You know what I mean? And I, I know you guys kind of, you know, that happened the same night and everything. I just want to get your thoughts on it. Yeah, it's crazy. That's, that's, that's super crazy and very disappointing. But me and Ja, we was locked, I mean, we was kind of locked up together. We was in the same holding tank everything now that same night we went to court the next day together and to know he got them too and to know i already didn't dealt with the situation and came home like i it, it, it's kind of you know what i mean mm-hmm. I, I would i would imagine it's, it's kind of it's a, it's a hard pill to swallow nah definitely man you know what i mean um you don't want to see no time on nobody in two years at is, all it's two years Shout out my nigga tip. Most definitely. Shout out to the homie Chip, of course. And shout out to my nigga Boosie. Shout out to the nigga Boosie. Now, I'm hearing through the grapevine, you know, I can't, like, nobody will tell me no information, no names, but I'm hearing it's possible a, a new member of Young Money is uh, about to be added. Oh, yeah. They, you know, there's always somebody new about to, try, about to, about to rock with us because I'm always searching and looking. But, yeah, I don't want, I don't want, I don't want to say no names right now, but... It's a great addition. So you can confirm that sometime soon we will see a great addition to Young Money. Yep, I can confirm that. But no hints or no first or last letters or nothing, huh? Nah, nah, I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> um, now that you're back in Miami, man, have you have you got a chance to to give the uh, the homies the, some encouragement, LeBron and Dwayne and them? Because I swear, once you got home, they started balling. I go to every game, but I, I just went to. I just came from the game and they was playing the Hornets. And um, the thing is about the Miami Heat game, everybody they play, right? I'm cool with somebody from off the opposing team every time. And you know, like it's a different type of cool. And I just like, oh, I know him now. I'm cool with him. Like we in the same gang, or uh, uh, you know, things like that. We 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 went we went way we go way back together. So mm-hmm. like they played they played the Hornets, and of course I was going for my Hornets and. I think I think I think I think Wade and um Wade and Brian Brian think I'd be against them all the time, man. I just um, <laughs> yeah, I, I think because after they don't for something, after they do something, they always look at me like I'm like, man, I, I don't have on a jersey. You know what I mean? Like, so I re- I want to clear that up and just let them know, you know, man, I, I got love for them as well, but they don't holler, they don't come holler at me. Like I said, the opposing team, I'm all as always somebody on the squad that come. Make their way during shoot around or whatever you want it to be. They come make their way and come holler at the boy. You know what I mean? I'm sitting, I come to every game. Brian, Brian, and D Wade ain't came holler at me yet. Oh so, man, that's that's kind of unbelievable. I can't believe that. Nah, that's real, and that's on everything. I've I've been every game since I've been home, and they ain't came holler at me yet. Not that I want, not that I'm I'm begging for them to come holler at me, but I mean. I'm, when, my, when the people from the other team come holler at me, then I might as well root for them. You know what I mean? Then they might be nervous. They, they might just be just got done finishing to the uh, listening to the Carter Three in the locker room. I mean, it's all good as always. It's all love. I, I rock with Brian. I've been rocking with Brian for a long time, and I've been rocking with D Wade for a long time as well. But like I said, man, they don't, they don't even niggas don't even get niggas don't even chunk the deuce up at, at the board. <laughs> yeah, you know I mean, and them tickets was them tickets was expensive, man. <laughs> now I know um, yeah. Brett Favre is, your, is is one of your favorite players, and you know, streak ended, man. He, uh, he it ended, and but you know one thing though, he he has some real strong words of encouragement, and um, you know, from from what I was hearing, he he was definitely had your back and and was making sure you, your situation was straight. Yeah, he did. I actually spoke to him while I was in there. He did have some good encouraging words for me, man. I really love that dude, man. I'm with him every step of the way. Did you also see the um, comments Bill Clinton said? Yeah, I saw the Bill Clinton comments. That's my dude, man. I got to get up with Bill one day. Man. <laughs> You and Bill, you've met Bill before, right? I think I've shaken his hand. That's about it. There it is, man. Shout out to the homie Bill Clinton. Um, Weezy, hold on. We got some more to talk about, of course. We're still going in. 80 Day Shade 45 is the number. Stay with us. 80 Day Shade 45. Morning show, Mr. Thanksgiving DJ Drama. We still got the homie Lil Wayne on the phone. Now, back to these rhymes, though, Weezy. Back to these rhymes. 
six seven. Um, we looking for that any day. Is there, do do we know when that record is coming out? When when can we prepare for that? This week. So we're gonna get the record this week for sure. For sure, you're definitely gonna get it this week. Only reason why we didn't put it, we were supposed to put it out today. Only reason why we didn't put it out today was because we're trying to make a good, we're trying to make a good ready, a good good radio, a good radio edit. Because I hate when radio stations make their own radio edits. Mm. It's, it's worse. Um, speaking of ROMs. You know, MTV did its uh, top ten list. Um, you came in at number seven. I, yeah, I, I heard. I heard specifically for shot from shot, and I'm I talk about the day it came out because I felt the same way. I, I said I don't know Wayne should be higher. I don't, you know, what I mean, I know the brother in jail and everything, but he should still be higher. Shot was like, yeah, he heard that you was upset by that. Uh, I was. I was. I'm not on front. I was. I was like, you know, I ain't, I didn't understand it. Somebody tried to try to explain it to me. Like, nah, it was a it was a list about this. They were trying to tell me that it was some kind of I don't know something. But I was like, you know, it's all good. Label me what you want to label me. Everybody knows them niggas ain't fucking with me, man. <laughs> yeah, I, I say on one positive note, you know, you did have your um, your, your young money crew on there, Nikki and, and oh, of Drake course, had, of course, had had of great course. uh great positionings. Yeah, of course. So the the streets and the fans would kill me if I didn't ask. Um, can we expect a dedication for in the near future? Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, so that's all they need. We leave it at that. Yeah, hell yeah. We Weezy, man, 6 7. We all waiting. The world is waiting. You know what it is, man. We're just happy to have you home, big dog. Thank you, man. Y'all know what it is. Um, I'm going to check in with you, big homie. All right. Love. Shade 45.